There it is. We are on, ladies and gentlemen. I don't know if you can hear the music or not. I don't know. I don't know why audio is so difficult for me. I, I don't know. I don't get it. But I'm not very good at it. <laughs> I cannot figure out the audio, at least the background music. Sometimes, last week it was my best. <laughs> Today, ladies and gentlemen, we are talking about Twitter for business, your secret ninja weapon. What is a ninja weapon? I don't know. I don't know what is. I don't know. But it is in the world of marketing, Twitter. The Twitter is your secret marketing weapon. This song is not even that good. <laughs> so without further ado, hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome to the Tool Show. You know why I hold it like that? You know why? Stop music. I don't think you can hear the music. I can. I'm over it. Bad choice, AJ. Uh, I, yeah. Like, I always, I, I always have to remind myself where I'm at. Am I at the system? Am I at the tools? I don't know where I'm at, but I do know. I do know we are at the tools, and welcome. We are, we got a, an amazing, fun-filled day for you today, ladies and gentlemen. 30 hours, 30, 30 hours. Yes, just 30 mere hours of Twitter for business. So get your jammies on. Let's do it. Now, just 30 minutes. Now it's, I think it's over already. So, uh, my man, what's up? What's up, Greggy? How are you, buddy? Are you good? Are you happy? Are you happy I good? The <laughs> greatest. The greatest ever? Of all time. This week went fast for me. It's not Did over. It go? That's true. I know. <laughs> I think it is because this show used to be on Friday. So oh, I'm still convinced that sweet. it's Friday. But it's not. Uh, in fact, now we have an 8.15 meeting tomorrow morning. Yeah, so that's good. That's nice. That. Yeah, I don't know, man. If Bob, if you're on here, what's up, buddy? Uh... Twitter. You still a Twitter fan? Love it. Love it? Really? Love it. Uh, you tweet, how often would you say you tweet? A few uh, times a week? Once yeah, a day? You don't really... No hard schedule for you're, me. You never, like, you never like wake up one day and say, you know, I didn't tweet anything yesterday? No. You never say never that. never think of that. Uh, why do you use Twitter? I don't know. Just for something to do? <laughs> I guess, yeah. You have no agenda. You're not trying to impress people, no. get a girlfriend, do no, uh, no make a million dollars. Nope, nothing. What, what stuff do you put on the Twitter? Like, what do you like to put on Twitter? Mm, today I, mean, I put an uncomfortable looking man up. <laughs> nice. I don't even want to go look. I don't know. I save that for my uh, own private time. Like, uh, how do you decide if you're going to share something? Uh, well, sometimes I'll share something because the people that follow me, I thought might like it. Hmm. Sometimes nice. I'll share nice. something because I'm bored. Yeah. Sometimes I'll share something as a way for me to remember something that I liked to come back to later. Oh, like so a little like book a bookmarking marking. thing. Yeah. That's nice. Uh, That's nice. Sometimes, it's, uh, yeah, I don't know. Yeah. So those are good reasons. But I think a lot of times people... I would say that sounds accurate of what most people do. Like, that's probably what I would say... Um, one of the things I find people doing a lot is they'll have in their header, they'll be like, I am the executive blah 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 of blah blah blue. And then they post everything about sports. Yes. That always annoys me. Yeah. Because I don't mind the sports. Mm -hmm. But when you, when you say, I am this, right. I, that's sort of like what I think you're going to be tweeting about. Right, the drapes don't match the curtains. Mm, true that. And... Uh, and I'm not saying that you shouldn't like, I'm not, you know, in fact, you're a, a, a Twitter stream about sports is probably way more engaging than a Twitter stream about marketing. I mean, that's why you don't post anything about marketing for the most part. Most I don't, I mean, yeah, yeah, right. I mean, just boring as hell, but I post a lot of marketing stuff and I get some engagement. Uh, look at here. I got you guys some stats on the Twitter. Show us some stats. Here they are. Oh my God. Are you ready? Little Mind us. Mind blown. Big, yeah. Are you, are you loving it? These are um, stats from Twitter. Uh, you have to say it that way. Twitter. I don't know if you knew that. 2015. That's, it's, it's, the, uh, the R is a, a soft you R. You know, a, Twitter. a stat came out this week. Yeah, what? You had said, uh, I think you had mentioned it. It was uh, about Google being the most trusted news source. I read now. that. Yes. And tweeted it. And I thought that was weird. You know why? Tell me why. Because yeah. I get my news from Twitter. 
Whoa. Like, you I would have. never even I've, go to. I've gotten my news from Twitter for years now. Yeah, yeah. And it's rare that I would go to Google for news. You never go to just Google or news.google.com? Like sometimes. Like, if you're sitting at work bored? No. You don't. I see, I do that sometimes. But what do you mean you go to Twitter for your news? Do you just, you go and see your stream and whatever is trending? Yeah, well, or like. whatever I, your people are talking so, about. So, okay. If I was to, say, want to find out what happened last week in Zimbabwe, yeah. I would not go to Twitter for that. You wouldn't? No. Why not? But if I want to know what's happening now, yeah, like as it's unfolding... You would go? I would go there. Do you just go to your feed like this? Yeah, and I've curated this. And you okay, know, sometimes so you'll follow maybe a trend or well, something you, you like that. You might go over here on the left and be like, oh, look, resolution fails, 15. Yeah. There you go. Uh, anyway. So yeah, okay. So so basically, if the people that you are following haven't talked about it, it's 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 not news to you, right? And sometimes that'll happen. Yeah. And I'll find out like I'll be like something happened, and I'll be like, what? Nobody even said anything about it. Yeah. Yeah. And it just then I try to actually like adjust my account, and I'll be like, well, that person was talking about it. Let's see what they did. So uh, and, you know, then maybe I'll follow them. So so you're actually fine tuning your Twitter. Yeah. To make it a uh, current events. Sort of, sometimes. Feed, almost. Sometimes. Yeah, yeah. And friends, probably, right? Friends. Like, yeah. Stupid things. That, yeah, funny things. Yeah. So it's It becomes everything. like a feed of, that you've tuned so that you can get, you can see the picture of the world that you want to see. Yes. Yeah. And it does allow you to kind of filter that way. Mm-hmm. Uh, so here, their mission. Did you know Twitter had a mission? I didn't. To give everyone the power to create and share ideas and information instantly without barriers. Okay. Okay. Right. That's good. That's good. Uh, Twitter usage, 284 million monthly active users. Uh, that's good, I guess. Um, 500 million tweets are sent per day. 80% of Twitter, act, uh, Twitter active users are on mobile. So this is a mobile-centric uh, platform. 77% of accounts are outside the U.S. Uh, that's kind of interesting. That I think that's happening with a lot of social media. We do not live in an American-centric uh, social media anymore. Uh, you know, that's been over for a while. Twitter supports 35 languages. Vine, which they own, more than 40 million users. And then uh, Twitter, they have they consume 1,440 hard-boiled eggs weekly. That's, I don't know if that's healthy. I think you should maybe apples. <laughs> Less hard-boiled eggs, more apples. But what do I know? Uh, so what I'm going to tell you is if you look at um, Twitter stats comparatively to other places, mm-hmm. like, um, you know, this is a nice graphic right here. Uh, so you can see here Facebook, 1.28 billion monthly active users. Uh, I don't know, you know, anyways, a lot. Then, technically, Google Plus comes in at 540 million active users, but I think that's a bold-faced lie because it's, I think, just Google, Gmail users. Well, I heard, yeah, the, so the Facebook and the Google numbers yeah, yeah. count, like, as an active user. Like, to be an oh, active boy, user, here it comes. Yes. if you uh, log in at all yeah. to leave a comment somewhere to yeah. use a different service that uses those credentials to get yeah. into it. Yeah. yeah. You count as an active user. Even Ugh, if you never go over sneaky there. Sneaky bastards. So. Yeah. So, and who doesn't, I mean, I do that all the time. It's like log in through my Facebook, mm-hmm. you know, uh, but then coming in third is Twitter at 255 million active users, then Instagram and then LinkedIn. And I just wanted to point this out that so many businesses are, you know, like I need to be on LinkedIn. But you should be aware that it's down on the list of users. And as Greg pointed out, which I think what a lot of people do, is they use Twitter for whatever they're into. Mm-hmm. So, like, for me, I use lists. And we can, that's another topic. But I organize my Twitter people by lists. And so I have an Akron list. I have a web marketing list. I have a business list, an entrepreneur list, an art list. And I pick the list of people that I want to look at based on what I'm feeling at that given time. Mm-hmm. But I, too, use it as a news feed mm-hmm. um, in that regard. 
Um, and, and it's a custom news feed as opposed to going to Google News that it's still like a top-down thing. Like Google News is telling me what, I th should, what should be important. And I don't, I'm over that. Mm -hmm. I, can, I can decide what's important, mm -hmm. you know. And uh, people will say, but this is important. No, not really. Not really. You know, mm -hmm. I, you know what am I going to do about it? What am I going to do about any of that stuff? So, you know, really. But so that is that. So uh, what we wanted to talk to you, all you fine people, about was this. Twitter for business. Business.twitter.com. We'll put it in the little doodad. Gunner Dash Whip Little. The name of the week. I love it. Says the audio is great. Awesome. Gunner Dash Whip Little, always needing to be referred to as Gunner Dash Whip Little. I like it. Every time, because that is genius. Gunner Dash Whip Little. Also like his brother. Yeah, who? Gunner Dash Whip Moore. Oh, nice, nice. I don't know how his brother yeah, had yeah. a different last name. No, they do it different in the Gunner family. Yeah, that's true. Last name is first. Ah, first name. The nice. Gunners. So anyways, uh, this is the deal, ladies and gentlemen. Are, have, you been, have you been using... Twitter to promote your business. I'm going to say maybe not. And maybe, I mean, you know, even if you have, we can, t you know, maybe we will shed a little light of, uh, you know, how to use it. So here are the things that uh, you can do. So here it's like, you know, do you need to grow, or create and manage a Twitter presence, grow a follower base, drive clicks or conversions to your website, increase Twitter engagements, install apps, find leads on Twitter. Uh, do you, are you, uh, ah, any time, Gunner Dash Whip Little, you deserve all the props you can get. Do you, uh, do you like Twitter for businesses? Do you like, do you like advertising the businesses on the Twitters? I can say that it is equally, can be equally annoying and also really cool. Uh, annoying as what the 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 advertiser or the advertisee as the person being advertised to oh you get a little annoyed well the re and here's the reason yeah like what you said like my twitter feed is a curated source of things yes. that i'm looking for yes carefully and so, called and so what you are doing as an advertiser would be shoving your content up in my space right like insta page right here right but so what i see is i see advertisers going two ways okay one just using it as a way to just push out whatever advertising crap they want yes to whoever yes and then two i see people who are carefully choosing the content that they're trying to push me Yes. And targeting me based off of my likes, what I am interested in, you know, things like that. So that when I see an ad come into my Twitter stream, it doesn't necessarily read like an ad. It reads as like something I would be actually interested in mm. exploring more. Yes. And those are very easy to spot the difference. In. Like, like, what do you mean? Like, what's one that like, is it more informational based? Like if you're just like, Hey, here's a coupon for something. I don't, yeah. I do not care. You're not, you're <laughs> not into that. I don't care. No. Right. But if you're like, Hey, check out this article that we wrote on this brand new virtual reality tech. Yeah. You know, and it's an actual thing like that. Well, yeah. you know, well, give it to me. What do you think of this ad, the Insta page one? Make your advertising more relevant by sending your ads to a landing page like this. Do you like it? That's a pretty okay, right? It's okay. I mean, it's, it's informational it's but selly. Don't you think it's remarkable? Mm, probably. Yeah. yeah. Like, so I've been to Insta page. Uh, and so, you know, and they're using, I think, probably a Twitter card right here. We'll mm -hmm. talk a little bit more about that. But then you just click the read more button, which is really nice. They give you this option of doing a read more and it takes you then to this, uh, this landing page. Create granting, great landing pages on your own. Sign up now. You that know? was last week. Uh, Insta page? Yeah, we, that's probably why we're seeing it because right. we <laughs> talked about it last week. That's exactly right. So, um, so that's very interesting. That oh, I, I was just talking to a guy today who said, I don't recommend social media at all to my customers because it doesn't work. And uh, I think that's not right. Yeah, I wouldn't say that was right. Um, it might not work, but more than likely, it's probably your, your, 
your messaging is not working. Yeah. Wouldn't you say? Yeah. I, I think. Um, and that's the problem we have here is that we take people that are advertising centric, like that they're like, well, give them a coupon, give them a commercial. Right. They love that. It's a, it's a, uh, you know, these are all like kind of like blanket statements though, right? Mm. I mean, so what does that even mean? I don't recommend social media. I don't what, know. Why? I don't, I don't know, dude. Twitter? They yeah, don't know. Advertising? No, no, none of it. I mean, no, they're over it. It doesn't work. It seems a little, little baby with the bathwater kind of yeah. little uh, heavy handed. Like if you were a law firm. Yeah. Would I suggest that you go and try and take over Pinterest? <laughs> no. Probably not. But could there be a place for you? Yeah. In social media somewhere? Sure. I could imagine a law firm actually doing, like, t doing an ad on a TV and doing one ad, one commercial, and being like, TV doesn't work. doesn't work for law lawyers. Mm -hmm. And I think that's what they do on social media. They're like, well, I did that and it didn't work. So what if you did an ad yeah. like, as a, a lawyer, a law firm yeah. or whatever? Yeah. And you like, it was based upon a search. Yeah. Right. Where people wrote the words like got arrested. Yeah. Or, yeah. you know, yeah. was injured in, you know, things like that. Yes. And so then you would serve ads based on that and location and yeah. uh, I see that working. I think it would be awesome, right? Try. Um, so here are the, what, six kinds of ads that you can create in Twitter. Followers, which is gaining more followers. Website clicks or conversions. Uh, both Facebook and LinkedIn now, I'm sorry, not LinkedIn. What does it matter? Not, actually, not LinkedIn. LinkedIn will not allow you to, to uh, measure for conversion, which is ironic being the business portal and all. But uh, Twitter and Facebook, you can monitor and track for conversions on your website. Tweet engagement, like sharing or, or uh, retweeting or favoriting. If you have apps, uh, we don't have a lot of clients that have apps, but if you do, uh, that I think that's very powerful, especially the, the number of how many people were on mobile. I mean, it's all mobile. Mm -hmm. You know, what a great place to promote your mobile app. And then leads on Twitter and custom. So let's, one of the, my favorites right now is website clicks or conversions. Okay, so let's just, let's just go in there and have a little look-see, shall we? Yes. So, yes. So let's do, uh, what we want is the uh, 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 system free trial. Okay, say drug system free trial, free for 30 days. Take over the internet, people. Okay, so. What, uh, what we're doing here is they're saying, you know, they're, so I have this and, it, and I've already set up conversion tracking. My tracking code has been verified. Your website tag will be used to show reporting for this campaign. Do you want it to start immediately and run continuously or do you want custom start and end dates? Very nice, I think. Compose or select tweets, okay? So here, use a website card to improve campaign form performance. To use different creative format, change your campaign objective. So what you can do here is, you can use existing tweets if you want. Uh, all right. It. Yeah. So at any rate, <laughs> that was a big one. Yeah. So um, anyways, <laughs> that was a big one, Gunner Dash Whip Little. So, uh, so, you know, so you can pick existing ones, but you can also say uh, change your business life. Try the Sage Rock system free capitals because they are cool with that for 30 days now what you can do here is then you can create a uh, card a Twitter card and I'm going to actually go to my insta I'm going to put in my landing page over here at insta page which is what we talked about uh, last week as Greg pointed out so I'm gonna go in here and I'm going to go to free trial free trial Okay, and uh, okay, we'll take this. Okay, good. We'll take that, and we'll go over here, and we will put in the website URL. Okay, and then I can add an image if I want. Okay, so I can just come in here, and uh, I don't know. We'll take rainbow you and me. There you go. I don't know why. So why not? So uh, there you go, do that. 
Okay, so, and then you can have a, you can have a headline, okay? Try the system free for 30 days. Change your life. I'm really into like overstating things right now. And then I can have a uh, call to action button. Let me make it a little bit bigger. Okay, which is, I could do bet now. I like that. <laughs> I don't know. Let's actually, I'm gonna run it for real. So like, uh, I'm just gonna go with learn more. And we'll just call it uh, Sage and Greg Rainbow. Because that's the thing. And then we can preview the card. Look at it, look how nice. Look how nice. Try the system for free. Change you life. That's perfect. <laughs> okay. Try the Sage Rock system. What? Stop. Come back. Listen. Listen. Artificial. Change your life. Although change you life would get more attention. Yeah. I'm not going to do it. They'll just yell at me. They'll just yell at me. And I get sensitive. So here, uh, okay, so here it is on the web. Here it is on an iPhone. Here it is on an iPad. And here it is on an Android. An Android, okay. Uh, and then what you click here is you can say tweet, promote it only. So now what I've done is I have made a tweet that is only to the promoted people. So, you know, because uh, I don't need to spam my regular people, all that. So here, then you go, you pick your location, United States of America. America, I tell you, yes. All the genders, the English language preferably. And then I can, I can select platforms, carriers. Oh, not the BlackBerry people. I'm over them. I'm over them. I'm sorry, BlackBerry people. Except if you're from Canada, then you're cool. Uh, but any American. No, I can't do it. Sorry. Then, uh, look, I can pick carriers. I can be like, yes, I will take the portable people, right? From Argentina. No, 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 no. Not the portable people. Have you run into them? Unbelievably arrogant. So yes, and then you can pick them all, yes. So there you go, I'll take them all, I'll take them all. Uh, target new devices. Target users based on when they first used Twitter on a new device. That's new, exciting, never seen that before, like it, like it. Then here comes the exciting moment. Are you ready, ladies and gentlemen? Select additional criteria for targeting. See, I ad-libbed those words, pretty nice. Users falling into any of these categories below, so. I could use a keyword like SEO. Yes, I can do that one. I can do, uh, here, look. Yeah, I'll just take it broad matched. There you go. I could take, um, what is another one? AdWords. See, I can do that. You see what I'm doing here? I'm adding words. I'm adding them. AdWords, I'm adding. <laughs> I'm a genius with the puns. Actually, not very good at puns at all. Uh, you know, you can do that. You get it? You feel me? You feel me? Then what? Wait, there's more. Then you can be like, Twitter, show people to my followers, or people like, I like to do Lee Odin, because he's a cool dude, and I think that his followers would enjoy the Sadrock system. Yes. Then I can do interests or browse by categories. How about business? How about advertising? Business software, mm, nah. entrepreneurship, yeah, sure, why not? Leader, marketing, yes, please. Small business and technology, yes, I like it, I like it a lot. Then add tailored audiences. Uh, if I have a tailored audience, I don't know that I have one. Oh, for all from the web, oh, look at here. Sadrock site visits, so I have created a remarketing group that allows me to uh, send ads, just like probably what we saw on the Insta page, to people that have been to the Sage Rock site. Yes, please, I will enjoy some of them. TV targeting, I don't know what this is. I don't know, what is this? People that like, I know. Uh, is uh, Walking Dead still on? It should be, it should never go away. There we go, Walking, Walking Dead, The Walking Dead. Wait, darn it. 
I don't know why I want the Walking Dead people, just because I love them, because they're rockingly awesome. I, I, I'm not gonna, I'm gonna undo that. I, I'm just gonna remove that show because I don't know. I think they're probably sickos. Yes, says something about me. Networks, like uh, TV targeting by network. Oh my God, it's amazing. Then genre, genre, ladies and gentlemen. You know who really loves marketing? Soap opera people. Yes, and variety. No, I'm good. I'm not going to do any of that. But you see what I'm doing here? Customize where it'll be, I guess, on their timeline. That's it. Uh, I can exclude tailored audiences. And then look at this. This, ladies and gentlemen. Why do I keep saying ladies and gentlemen? Because I imagine you all are. We have no savages on this show. New pricing model. You only pay the first time a user clicks on a link or website card in your ad. Steve would like that. Mm. Steve, man, he's he sick of the people clicking multiple times in the ad words. So you only pay for the first click, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, uh, it is required per day. I don't know, $10 a day. Mm. I'm made of $10 a day. Uh, let's see, set a bid. Uh, this is new. It says so right here. That's how I know. Twitter will automatically enter bids to optimize this campaign. Or I can manually set it uh, by the per click. I, automatic sounds pretty sleazy to me, but I, whatever, whatever. And then I could be like a total budget. I can be like $100. There you go. And then, and then if you look over here, if you, then you'll see what, are I'm going, what I'm going to target. You see, you can see this is my audience here, the audience. And then you can see over here, wait, where'd it go? Uh -huh, can you see it? Can you see it? Uh, I'm gonna start now. I'm gonna stop after $100. I'm gonna pay at most $10 a day. I have no bid set. They're gonna just do whatever. And I'm going to reach less than 1,000 people. Why? Because I don't have enough money. I'm not gonna do this, Greggy. Don't yeah, worry. Okay. Don't worry. Thank you. I, don't, I don't know what I'm gonna, now I'm still gonna reach, anyways. 100, 100, that's fine. Okay, so there it is. I can recap, I can modify, I can save as a draft and exit, and I can launch. And I launched it, I launched it, okay? So let's take a look at some campaigns. Oh my God, the half hour is almost over. Where does the time go? Flux capacitor, it's, it's, it's going crazy. So here, let's look at some campaigns from the past. Shall we, shall we? Yes, we shall. Uh, let's see here. What is going on? Actually, let's do this year. No, last quarter. Let's do last quarter. Okay. Uh, so let's see. What have I got here? So let's take the free WordPress class one. Okay. It cost $157. It got 10,590 impressions. It got 270 engagements, which is clicks or something or other, a 2.55% engagement rate at a cost of 58 cents an engagement, okay? And this was an engagement one. This was not a conversion one. Uh, what I'm going to tell you is in my industry, 58 cents per engagement is awesomely awesome. I cannot get anywhere near that rate uh, in AdWords. So my industry is saturated, very, very expensive in the, uh, in the Google AdWords. So I like advertising in Twitter and Facebook and YouTube, YouTube. Um, would you say these people should try this? Okay. Yes. Do See it. there? Resounding, a resounding yes. yes. Do it now. Uh, Gunner Dash Whiplittle says, I think the point of the non-tech Twitter lover is that Twitter is a tactic, not a strategy. Yes, uh, where are the ads appearing on the page? Gunner Twit Literal or wants to know. Uh, <laughs> in the news feed. In your feed. Yes, yep. yes. Uh, uh, so perhaps it is a time and place. Maybe you can touch upon this because frankly it seems like more of a gathering tool, hence banned in certain countries, prone to revolutions. Wow, I did not know that. I did not know that. Like North Korea probably doesn't like it. Uh, but they do like the uh, Dennis Rodman. So at any rate, figures. So uh, it is a gathering thing. Um, I would say that you should not expect to make any sales. It is a, it is a tactic. And it is a tactic. And a tool. And a tool. Not a strategy. True that. 
strategies have goals. There, I, I, I typically think of a strategy as something that's made up of tactics and goals. That's, that's pre, I think that's a pretty accurate description of a strategy. We want to increase our web traffic by X amount. That's the goal. Over a certain period of time. Yes. Here's how we're going to do it. These are the tools that we're going to use to make that happen. Yes. And so you're going to have tactics. Sure. But yes. I mean, like me just running this right now is a tactic. It's tactical. <laughs> I, I, sort of. In it's a weak a way. Joke. I know. I know. But uh, <laughs> I might get somebody. You might. Who yeah, knows, I right? I don't. Uh, <laughs> um, what would be better what would be sitting down and saying, Greg, I would like more... Um, uh, system free people and we would come up with ideas mm -hmm. and we would be like okay well that seems like a reasonable thing how could we do that well we have all of these different tactics or tools uh, so you know like we could email them we could mm -hmm. buy we could do direct mail we could do phone calls we could do twitter we could do facebook we could do adwords ah, so like many a lot. things and we will say that we are willing to pay no more than ten dollars per poor uh free trial yeah and you'd be like look if i can get if you can get a free trial for 10 bucks let's do it right on and then you have goals and you could be like look you know what i'm looking for a free lead a free trial for less than ten dollars and you know what does that ladies and gentlemen this show oh less which reminds $10. me of something yes what i was just strategizing in my head here Whoa, bring and it, i was baby. wondering if you could figure out the tactic needed to yes. bring my strategy to life oh bring it just lay it on the table let's fillet this fish we need to end this show man how are we gonna do it i don't know how are we gonna do it man how are we gonna do all it right. Sage? all right i'm gonna rewind rewind uh good show i'd say Good show, chap. Okay. Yes. All right, you all. You guys rock, especially Gunner Dash Whip Little. And if Gunner Dash Whip Little is not his name, I hope he comes up with a clever name next week. Mm. Because Gunner Dash Whip Little is in the running for the other name I really like. Uh, where was it? Digger T. Dinkins. Also good. If Digger T. Dinkins <laughs> is... Gunner Dash Whip Little. This guy's a genius. <laughs> A freaking naming genius. You should have children just to name them. <laughs> all right, everybody, have a great week, and we will see you all next time. You gotta... oh, yeah, I never know which one it is. Bye. Bye.